firefighters in Depew are investigating what started a house fire that has left a family homeless. And tonight, the Quillos family is thankful to be alive because a 7 Eyewitness News reporter, Ala Araby, tells us neighbors came to the rescue when their Norman Drive home burst into flames. Not a single one of us had shoes on. I mean, we had the clothes on that we had worn through the day. We had socks and just threw everybody in the van and just left. Kelly Quillis lost her home and everything in it Thursday evening. We were watching TV and all of a sudden it got dark in the room. And I jumped up and I looked out the back window and I, that's smoke. So I went to the other side of the room to pull the shade up and look into the driveway next door and there was a, just a, like a volcano shooting up the flames. The fire started in the garage and according to neighbors, there was a mailman around the corner who saw the fire, saw the smoke, came to the door, banged on the door and got everyone out. And for him, I don't, you know, who knows? Quillis quickly put her boys and the family's dogs in the car and pulled out of the driveway to safety. Neighbors Jim and Marlene Drezwicki saw the fire and called 911. They then ran next door. When they didn't see Quillis's car in the driveway, they waited for her to come back because that's what neighbors in this community do. I've got some health problems and she's been cutting the grass once in a while or snowboarding in the wintertime and, you know, we don't ask. Her. She just comes over and does it. Quillis is now staying with her sister. A GoFundMe page set up by relatives has already raised more than $21,000. I love all of them. They're just, they're fantastic. I couldn't ask for a better neighborhood to live in. You'll find a link to the GoFundMe page at WKBW.com. In Depew, Ala Araby, 7 Eyewitness News.